Seth Lugo, who's given up one run in 12 and two thirds innings. Jose Altuve digs in to face Seth Lugo. That's low or outside. Either way, it's a walk at Altuve. On base yet again, all 13 games this year. Here's the right guy at the plate to try to give them an early lead. Jordan Alvarez. Broke his bat. And Junior goes out from short to make the play. Right inside his hands. And Melendez is there. Altuve goes back to tag. Uh, he will hold at first base. Two out and a man at first for Alex Bregman. Fastball on the outside edge. So Lugo isn't bothered by the leadoff walk. There he is making his major league debut, Spencer Arigetti. Arigetti, two starts at AAA Sugarland this year. A 2.16 ERA in eight and a third innings. Michael Garcia leads it off. Called third strike. Arigetti with a strikeout of Garcia to start his big league career. Now it's Bobby Witt Jr.'s turn, the shortstop. Swing and a miss. Back-to-back -back strikeouts right out of the gates in his big league debut. Eric Getty, Getty Garcia and Witt Jr. And now Salvador Perez. Pitch home is swung on and popped up. Jose Abreu is underneath it. Altuve also drifting over. It's Abreu who will put it away. And Spencer Aragetti has a shutout first inning with a couple of strikeouts and a pop-up. Yiner Diaz leads off the second inning. And that misses a little high for ball four. That'll bring up Chaz McCormick. Now he shows a fastball, slowly hit towards second. Pena really forced the issue. The throw is wide, and Jeremy's going to get to third. Jeremy was right on top of Bobby Witt. And Frazier threw it wide. So now runners on the corners with one out, and Jose Abreu will hit. And a good chance for a double play. All those ground balls, all those chances. <laughs> and Lugo still ends up with a scoreless inning. How are we feeling? How's everyone doing? We have a lot of family here, but how is everyone feeling right now? Uh, we're great. Now that that first inning is over, prior to that, I uh, wasn't sure I was going to be able to keep anything down. You know how that goes. <laughs> but uh, there's been a lot of tears over the past 24 hours. You know, this has been a dream come true for my son. He, at 10 years old, told me this is what he was going to do. Nelson Velazquez, the batter. And that's the first hit he's allowed as a big leaguer. And now the batter will be Hunter Renfro. Another 2-2 pitch. This one popped up on the infield. Abreu and Altuve on the right side. Who wants it? It's going to be the second baseman, Altuve. Two good innings for Spencer Aragetti. Jake Myers will lead things off here in the third inning. To Vinny. And Lugo just beats Myers to the bag. So one out for Altuve. Altuve hits this one hard down the left field side. That's going to get to the wall. Altuve around first. He'll get into second base with a one-out double. He's on base for the second time tonight. There's Kyle Tucker. Swinging 3-0 on a breaking ball. And that's the second 3-1 scoring play of the inning. Number nine hitter Kyle Isbell leads off. Spun off the end of the bat. Tough play for Pena, and he'll have no play. The 1 0 pitch, Isbell runs, fastball high. Diaz's throw on target, but late. Isbell dives in safely just ahead of the tag. Brings up Bobby Witt Jr. Two on, one out for Vinny Pasquantino. Pasquantino punches it down the left field line toward the corner. Fair ball. Isbell rounds third. He's in to score easily. Here comes Witt. He races around third. He scores standing without a throw. Two run double, Vinny Pasquantino. The Royals have a 2-0 lead in the bottom of the third. His first extra base hit and his first RBIs of the 2024 season. Salvador Perez at the plate. Perez loops it, shallow center. Meyer sprints in, flashes the leather, it drops for a base hit. Pasquantino had to wait to see if it would be caught. He advances to third. And the bases are loaded for Nelson Velasquez. Melendez slaps it through the right side, base hit into right field. Pasquantino scores. Wilson waves Salvi around third. Here's the throw up the third base line. Salvi touches home plate with his left hand. Two run single, Nelson Velasquez. The Royals double their lead. It's 4 0 in the bottom of the third. There's Adam Frazier. The 1 2, carved back up the middle, base hit center field. Melendez in to score standing. Velasquez goes to second, rounds the bat, now takes off for third. Myers bobbled the ball in center. Adam Frazier collects an RBI single. 5 0 Royals in the bottom of the third. So here's Hunter Renfro. Slider punch down the right field line. Fair ball. 
bouncing toward the right field corner. Velasquez comes in to score standing. Frazier on his heels. He crosses as well. Renfro's into second. A two-run double. The Royals have busted this game open in the bottom of the third. It's 7-0. Back to the top of the lineup and Michael Garcia. That has popped up. Should be playable. Yiner Diaz, Alex Bregman, both in foul territory. They collide. And Diaz holds on to it for the final out of the inning. Here's Bregman. First pitch from Lugo is hit in the left center field. A long run for Isbell. And he is going to have to play it off the wall. Bregman with a loud double off the left center field wall. Here's Yiner Diaz. Instead, he pulls one to left field. Well hit. Back on it goes the left fielder. Melendez leaping up. It's off the wall. Bregman's going to score. Yiner Diaz to second base. An RBI double. And the Astros are on the board. It's now 7-1. Jeremy Pena is the batter. And he chops one towards third. This could be trouble. Garcia's going to play it. And once he played it, he had no shot. Tried to throw back to get Yiner. Runners on the corners now for Jose Abreu. And that ball into shallow center. Should be deep enough. Yiner's going to come home, and the throw will be not in time. That'll be a sack fly. It's 7-2. to two. Brandon Belak's in there for the Astros. Comes Vinny Pasquantino. Change up, hit high in the air, deep right field. Tucker's back, out of the track, at the fence, and it's gone! Vinny Pasquantino's got his first home run of the year. He battled and battled and battled and then sent it out. How about two? Extra base hits for Pasquantino tonight. Three RBIs, and the Royals are up 8-2 to two in the bottom of the fourth. Michael Garcia steps to the plate. Up and away, ball four. Mashinsky delivers. Garcia runs. Breaking ball misses low. Pops away from Diaz. Garcia's into second standing. Brings up any Pasquantino, who's had a much-needed big night. First pitch to Pasquantino. Garcia takes off for third. Pitches in for a strike. Throw to third. A little high. Garcia slides in underneath it. Breaking ball slapped to straightaway center. Drives Myers back. He's behind it, makes the catch. Garcia tags up from third. He's in to score easily. Another RBI from Vinny Pasquantino, his fourth of the game. Hunter Renfro draws the leadoff walk. Now Hampson bats. And he lines one hard into left field. That's going to hook into the corner. Around second on his way to third, Hunter Renfro. He'll touch third base and come all the way home on the double by Hampson and the Royals lead it 10 to 2 and here's Benny Pasquantino how about a five RBI game yes oh yeah way to go Benny the Kansas City Royals one out away from a six game winning streak popped up Lofton is there and the Royals have won six in a row.